scripture first with our friend Scripture Lee because rooted in y'all's word is the way we should be. Getting up in the morning, it's time to go, go, go. It's time to show y'all's light. It's time to grow, grow, grow. Let's learn our scripture first with our friend Scripture Lee because rooted in y'all's word is the way we should be. His name is Marley. Do you want to see him? Okay. Here he is. Can you say hi, Marley? Hi. He's cute, but he did something today that made me mad. Can you guess what it was? What did you do? That's a good guess. He chewed my favorite shoe. That wasn't very nice of him. And he didn't say sorry either. Did you? I'm sorry you chewed your shoes, but he looks nice. Yeah, Rob, I know you overcame your fear of dogs last episode, but I'll put Marley down. Can you say bye, Marley? <laughs> Friends, did someone ever do something that made you mad? Or what makes you mad? I see. What about you, Rav? I don't like getting splashed, and when people splash me, it makes my wings droopy. Hmm. Okay. Well, let's see if scripture can help us out. Oh, scripturely! Hey, scripturely! Do you have a scripture for us? Yeah! Hmm. Proverbs 15 and 1. Let's see what it says. Proverbs 15 and 1. A soft answer turns away wrath, but a harsh word stirs up anger. Thanks, Scripturely. Here is something to help us remember it. Proverbs 15 and 1. A soft answer turns away wrath, but a harsh word stirs up anger. Hmm. Wrath and anger were the same signs. That must mean they're related. Mm-hmm. Cause and effect. Also, a soft answer is like a gentle response. Oh, really? Well, I was gentle with Marley when I took my shoe back and said, Marley, no chewing shoes. He didn't get mad, so I didn't stir up his anger. That's good. And counting to three before responding helps with a soft answer. Oh, I did that and took a deep breath too. It helped me respond gently. Let's count to three. Okay. One, two, three. Proverbs 15 and 1. A soft answer turns away wrath. But a harsh word stirs up anger. Oh no! That's scripturally's bell. That means we're about to be ported to do what we preach. Is that someone coughing? Whoa. Hi friend, are you okay? No, someone clapped the erasers. I'm gonna yell at them. Whoa. Well maybe this approach may work better. What's that? Let's show our friends. Do it with me. Okay. We count to three. One, two, three. Breathe in. And remember, Proverbs 15 and 1. A soft answer turns away wrath, but a harsh word stirs up anger. I feel much better. You're right. If I yell, maybe she'll yell. And who knows, it could have been a mistake. I'll just say I didn't like it. Thanks a lot. You're welcome. <laughs> Scripture leaves bow. Here we go. Oh, <laughs> man. Oh, no, what's the matter? 
<laughs> Man, this referee gave me a foul. It wasn't fair. Well, what did you say? Well, I gave him a piece of my mind. Yeah. Well, maybe not. But maybe there's a better way to respond? Yeah, what better way is that? Let's show him, friends. Do it with me. So first, we count to three. One, two, three. Breathe in. And remember, Proverbs 15 and 1. A soft answer turns away wrath, but a harsh word stirs up anger. Yeah, it made him angry too, so you know what? Let me go apologize yeah, to him. That's a good idea. have been good for me to sting the car. It may have been dangerous. Yeah, friends. Thanks. I think it's time to go back and find Scripturely. Let's go. Thanks for helping us to apply God's Word. Mm -hmm. We learned a lot. Yeah, thanks Scripturely. It was fun. Yeah. Proverbs 15 and 1. A soft answer turns away wrath, but a harsh word stirs up anger. Let's remember to count to three when we get mad. Cool. Well, fun time learning with you, friends, and we'll see you next time here on Scripturally with Scripturally. Remember to count to three and remember Proverbs 15 and 1. See you next time. Hey parents, if you and your kids like our content, please like this video and subscribe to support our channel. Share with those who you think it could help as well. We have an activity center for kids at ancientpathkids.com and you can visit ancientpathadventures.com to check out our product. Follow us on social media at Ancient Path Adventures to keep up to date. Until next time, bye!